look at this. Look at it. Hello beautiful people, how's it going? I'm back with another video and today we're watching Star Wars The Clone Wars. We've been binging this series for the past, I think, month now and we're almost near the end of the first season. And I'm very excited. If you're new to my channel, hello, I react to things that I've never seen before. We did Star Wars, Lord of the Rings, Pirates of the Caribbean, and so on and so forth. So you should subscribe because we're so close to 40k and it would mean the entire world to me. Also, if you would like to, you can pledge to me on Patreon where you can request for your own content that you'd like me to react to or if you just want to support the channel. And of course, as I always do, I have to plug my Instagram. If you'd like to communicate with me, the best way to do it would be on Instagram because I reply to all of my messages. So if you give me a follow there and then say send me a message, we can get in contact and it'll be so fun. So anyways, the Clone Wars. I, uh, I did some shopping this week. <laughs> I got a call from my local Funko shop that this bad boy, which I pre-ordered about five months ago, before I even finished <laughs> the Mandalorian series, um, had finally come. And guys, I want you, I want you guys to look at it. I didn't want to make its own video because I just felt like maybe not a lot of people would have wanted to see it. So this is baby Yoda. Well, or the child. I will say he's actually kind of different because on this 10 inch, he's actually smiling. Whereas on the regular pop, which you guys already know, I own and adore. <laughs> he's frowning. So I need to find a way to display him somewhere here where my Star Wars collection is. But for now, this is the child and we're about to watch the Clone Wars. So I hope you guys are excited. Okay, let's hear it. Let's see it. Ignore your instincts at your peril. What does that even mean? Viceroy Gunray captured. Senator Padme Amidala has scored a victory against the Separatist Alliance so cool. on the remote world. The Jedi Council has dispatched Master Luminara Unduli and Anakin Skywalker's Padawan Ahsoka to escort the Vice oh. to Coruscant under okay. heavy guard. So I'm assuming we're only we're getting in a Captain, like an Ahsoka-based episode. Yes, we'll catch you through now. It's been a while. A tranquility. This is. I look forward to delivering him to you. I am a man of great very wealth, English. and I can be very generous to my allies. That is a very tempting offer, Viceroy. In the meantime, I have a gift for you. <laughs> this is an outrageous miscarriage of justice. I demand my litigator. Keep moving. Greetings, General. Have oh my God, who is that? Traitor. <laughs> this guy looks very sus, I'll just tell you that. Senate commandos, don't let your overconfidence give Gunry another advantage, Ahsoka. Even now, his allies may be conspiring against us. See, this is the thing. Look how a woman speaks to Ahsoka. Very respectfully. But Anakin, on the other hand, and don't kill me for saying this, I'm just saying my opinion. I have already put a plan into action, my lord. Oh, I haven't I seen Dooku in a while. Asajj Ventress. Ventress. You are putting a great deal of faith I don't know if I've seen Palpatine in the show so far. Maybe I just does. forgot. She is a gifted assassin. Every time I hear Palpatine's voice, I just think, Do it. <laughs> Do it. Master. There is no margin for error this time, child. Must prove yourself. I just want to know why she doesn't have hair. That's just something that I want to know. How goes the interrogation? Has the Viceroy cracked? Not yet. You know, the New Zealand accents are really growing on me. I can sense your concern. The locations of their bases. I am in well, can she read minds? Can she read minds? Whining. Tell us what we want to know right now, or I will gut you like a Rokarian dirtfish. <gasps> what does that even mean, Ahsoka? Um, perhaps I was too hasty. Let us negotiate. Wow. Ahsoka, you're getting it done. Right. Ooh. I've never seen those before. Oh. Oh. Oh, yikes. Mm. Yeah, that is, that is not good, guys. That is really not good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, 
I'm sorry, homies. You guys are in serious trouble, man. Lightsabers are so sick. When you know how to use them, you have to know how to use a lightsaber. Because, like, imagine if you can't deflect, if you're, like, really bad at aiming or, like, receiving aims. Like, imagine if you can't deflect it. What, what then? <laughs> She can definitely jump, I'll give her that. Say anything? The enemy's advancing toward the prison level. We're on our way. Oh my god, it's gonna explode. Is it a bomb? It probably is. She really can jump. Is she gonna blow the entire thing up? See, the reason it looks cool is because she knows how to use a lightsaber. I was thinking about this. Looks like the last time, General. I guess that's why Jedi's actually have to train. Sounds like your rescue didn't work out after all. I am ready to dis Aha. I've got the all clear. The enemy Yeah, that really wasn't funny. <laughs> Y'all are so screwed. If it isn't the hairless harpy. Yeah, see? Why she bold? With that double lightsaber action. Yeah, she doesn't need Anakin. Let's hope she's right. <laughs> that was weak. That's okay, even I'm disappointed in you now, I'm sorry. It'd be amazing if she kills her. I just want to be done with this villain. <gasps> oh, you guys are so dumb. Please. Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. I am more than capable of dealing with a lone assassin armed with undisciplined fighting skills. But stay here. I really like, like imagine if Anakin wasn't her, her master. Imagine if she was. I would love it a lot more. And I know you guys love to hate on me when I hate on Anakin. I'm not hating on him. I'm just saying, for example, for me, I used to always feel a lot more comfortable and I succeeded more when I was taught by teachers who showed me respect. But that's just my opinion. Even though I disagree with the whole superior to droids thing because it's kind of racist, I agree with what he's saying. Sloppy. <laughs> See, her jobs work better than Ahsoka's. Which is unfortunate because I know she's a minor character. Man. What? There's a lot of action in this episode. It's not what I expected. I like the use of the color scheme in this. This is cool. We have this, to find her. this is a team up I never knew I wanted, but it's shaping up pretty well. What are you doing? I knew it. I knew it. I knew he was sus. I just knew he was suspect. This is one of the coolest lightsaber battles I have seen so far, and I am saying that wholeheartedly, completely in confidence. Oh, oh, he took him out. I did not see him. Look at his hair. Of course he's sus. Oh my god. I think she's gonna escape. Because I know we're not done with this one. I know we're not. Oh my god, she actually did it. Yeah, see? It's a shame that Ahsoka failed. Alright, so that was actually a really fun episode. I'm gonna be honest, you guys. We are in the middle of exam season, and I do not have the time to give these episodes the amount of love that I would usually give them, and I hope you guys understand. So unfortunately, today we are not watching two episodes, but by the end of this week, we will be back on track, and we will be back to watching two episodes twice a week, so that's four episodes a week. I know you guys are being very patient with me, and I appreciate you guys so much. Honestly, your support means the world, but let's talk about this episode. I really liked Ahsoka in this episode. I understand she failed her mission. I completely get that. And you know what? People fail sometimes. 
It's completely okay, but as long as she's learning. And she's learning because she is a Padawan to Anakin, but in this episode, she kind of felt like a Padawan to this lady, who I do not know the name of, which I'd like to highlight. Do not kill me in the comments for this, because I swear I am, <laughs> I have almost had it <laughs> with the comments on my Clone Wars videos. I've almost had it. I just, I'm not hating on Anakin. I love Anakin. I loved him in the prequels. But I just feel like sometimes he is disrespectful to his students. And I understand that like in military or in school or whatever, teachers always feel some sort of higher power over their Padawans or students or whatever you want to call them. But me as a person, I have always gravitated and done better when I was under the influence of people who were supporting me in a loving way. Maybe that's just my personality, but in my opinion, the reason that Ahsoka is not improving as much as she needs to be at this point in the show is because Anakin constantly ridicules her in public, but that's just my opinion. And honestly, I don't even want to hear it. I mean, I love you guys, but I really don't want to hear it because the comment section of the Clone Wars videos have been really upsetting. Some of you guys are really mean, honestly, and it, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I shouldn't be saying this. I should not be saying this. But anyways, thank you guys for so much, so much, so much for watching. If you guys made it this far, I love you guys so much. If you guys made it this far, comment Ahsoka deserved better. Because she does deserve better. But that's just my opinion. I don't know. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.